Hello there guys, it's Children Gaming. How's everyone doing? Uh, right, so I'm actually doing this post-commentary because unfortunately, um... <laughs> unfortunately my, uh, my recording setup kind of messed up. So, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to record the audio a bit separate. It's going to be a little bit louder than usual, but I'll see what I can do with that. So yeah, last time we did, uh, three point... Four three point three? No, we did three point four. Yeah, three point four and three point three. So we're doing three point five now. On to three point six. Yeah. Despite the fact that I literally just recorded this, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> so, as we start off, basically we're doing a. <laughs> we're doing this mission here so this what this all of the all of this is just basically water physics for this one this first one isn't actually that that hard and I think I miss one villager which I then have to go back and uh, have a look oh this will be in the same format as murder videos the only difference is going to be the fact that I am recording this after uh, no, I'm I'm doing the voiceover after the recording. Despite <laughs> the thing is, basically, I was just all talking to myself throughout the whole video uh, process, which is great. Uh, well, anyway, we are moving right along on the my little favorite monster in the game, <clears throat> the little hippo block-looking things. Come on, you have to say that they're... Look, they're adorable. Well, I don't know, I find them adorable. I don't know what's wrong with you guys, but... I don't know. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. Uh, well, besides that... Uh, yeah, I get a bit confused here. There's a simpler way of doing this. Like, the thing that I was looking at was the, the villager, not the... <laughs> Not the solution to this puzzle. I was like, oh my god, there's a village there. I need to get him. Literally just did that. All sorts of wrong. <laughs> As I said, I did this all sorts of wrong. Should have done... I should have done it the opposite way. But anyway, moving on to this next one. Uh, yeah more water levels now here I was a bit I was struggling to get into there there's a chest I picked that chest up and uh, yeah we move right along I still cannot figure out how to get there until I finally realize that since I can't jump in there how about I just sink all the way to the bottom and go what am I doing Basically, the, the thing about this is, you sink straight to the bottom, and then you just become block pip to launch yourself straight up to the... Yeah, exactly. You kill those guys, you go into this pip, and then you just drop down and keep going on your merry way. And... Whoop! To the next villager! Yeah! Okay. So, we keep going. We wait. And we move on to this level, right? This level. This part of the level is... It's not bad. I nearly get squished right there by the block, but the block... Then I evade the block. Um, so, I've actually got some, some news. So I went to my doctor on Tuesday? I think it was Tuesday. Uh, and I actually found out that I've got foot drop. And basically, what foot drop is, it's um, it's a, it's not recognition. Basically, it's a, it's all about, it's all about your nerves and your tendons or ligaments in your in your leg affecting your dorsiflex of the foot. Now, dorsiflex is allowing your foot to bend upwards. So, let's say you try and tap your foot. To the ground, you know, to a beat. 
I actually can't do that with my left foot. I can't even walk on my heels because it's that bad. Now, it hurts a little bit sometimes. It feels weird most of the time. But the thing that's really worrying me is... Uh, is the fact that... Uh, you know, it's going numb. Like, most of my foot is going numb. So, uh, yeah, right there I didn't really think about what I was doing, but we get through it. So, yeah, my foot is numb most of the time. And, uh, yeah, it fucking sucks. Honestly, it just sucks. Alright. Now, here I actually do something completely and utterly... Well, it's not stupid, it's actually well hidden. I didn't even notice it. But, right there... In between, right in the middle of those blocks, or near the bottom, I think, there's actually um, there's actually a little pathway, which, as you can see, I literally just ignore it. I literally just ignore it, and uh, I just carry on. Okay, so this this puzzle here. Puzzle right here is really. It was a bit hard to figure out. But, well. Ding, idiot. Uh, so, jump. Go there, go there, and then you just jump off the wall to get to this area. And you grab the block and you bring it right back there to get to this guy and completely and utterly miss and now you have to repeat the whole process. Good job me, right? I have no idea why I can't do platforming. <laughs> and there we go. Keep going. There we go. Oh, okay. It's fine guys, it's fine. I actually I actually went I actually got through this level. And bonk. Now this is the bit where I, where my brain switches off, and I forget about the whole physics of this game. Now what did we learn? What did we learn? Yes, you float all the way down, and you switch. Yes, yes, Gonzo, you're doing great. Except you missed. You don't even need to go the other pip, yes. Okay, go with the other pip then. Yeah, you don't need to go the, th the the third version. You could just switch up to the second. So yeah, yeah, yeah. This, is, this is about the moment where I realize I don't have the villager. Great. So, uh, yeah. At this point, I think... Yeah, the level finishes. I talked to you guys about... Oh, right, yeah, we missed a villager. I'll be right back. Then I do some crazy fade-in moments, and uh, we go to the next part. Like so. So, yeah, I'm now going to put up the video on the left. There you go. Boom, that's how you get the villager. And now we're moving on to the, uh, to the next level as well. The next level, luckily, I actually managed to get the villager on that level. All the villagers, anyway. Now, this one... Really irritating. Why, you ask? Well, these blasted bugs. Bug. Actually, I still haven't decided if these are two amalgamations of two... Uh, what are they called? Uh, I forgot uh, what they were called. It's the bugs that have, like, the glowy butts. Uh, and, uh, yeah. It's like a little amalgamation of both. You guys can probably notice. But yeah, these guys are irritating. Not now. You see that, that one that one gave me a nice piece of juicy chicken. Mm. But that's not the point. The point will come later within the video. Like this part. Now this part is irritating. So obviously the the point of this is to use whatever means necessary 
to go up into into that top part with the with the gu air geysers. Yeah, as you can see, I'm having the worst time here right now. <laughs> and I'm probably going to die in 3, 2, 1. And then. Yeah, it's really irritating. <laughs> this one has you, has you think about other ways of platforming, incorporating the damn bugs into, your, into the equation. Which is really irritating, because these guys have a little... A set path... Mind you, a set path of going up and down, peaks and troughs, guys. If you've, uh, if you either do music or if you've done science or maths, yes, there are three subjects that use these. No, wait, four. I think physics. Yeah, physics does that. But yeah, it's really irritating. Despite the fact that it's set path, it's actually really hard to find where their hitbox is for you to go up. To jump on him. There's me swinging my sword and finding out that those actually break. Boy, was I surprised. At this point, I was like, "Oh, look, a piece of chicken," which is going to do do me a world of good. I still. Oh, there we go. And also, there's a villager right there in the top corner. Which I've noticed, and I was like, I'm gonna get the villager. So I get the villager, and I. See, look at that! That is shenanigans. That was shenanigans. Sir. Mr. Bug. So this is me trying to figure out how do I get this villager. And obviously, being the smart person that I am, and getting my myself trapped there, I actually managed to get the villager nice and easy. This bit scared me because I was like, oh no, no, oh, get the pixels. He's like, eh, I was like, see, that's not fair. You can't scare me like that. Now, I can't remember what was going through my head when I did this. Well, obviously, what was going through my head was, oh, I probably have to use the same thing I used before. Before, pardon me. To try and get to the top there. And then I'm like, nah, that can't be it. There's no there's no space big enough. So I just go the the same route. Now. I cannot remember what happened here. Alright, oh, I just take the hits because I have what? Seven hearts? Three, five, yeah, I got seven hearts. So I literally just take the hit and just go. And so far, yeah, so far everything's nice, you know. Taking a bunch of hits, and uh, yeah, getting that, jumping down. Look, look, see, the hitbox on these guys is stupid. Because I am trying my very best not to get hit, and these guys keep it. Look, there you go. So basically, if they're flying below you, you can't really, can't really do much. Now this pit, this bit is the most annoying part of this map so far. I have lost my composure so many times during the next area. This area is stupid. Now, the thing is, you know what you can do. You know what you have to do. But the thing is, you've got these bugs flying around and they're distracting you. And you lose your shit most of the time. You lose your shit. Now, this next bit, which is the ending. Yeah, there's a villager up there. I get every villager in this in this level, but here's the kicker: you actually don't reach that platform. I was skeptical at first. I was like, "There's no way I can't reach that platform. There is no way." So yeah, I I literally just try my best just to s look. Look, 
I am so I am so annoyed that I can't hit the damn one block platform. See, l l look what these bugs did to me. Oh, don't worry, guys. You you won't be hearing that beeping for very long, uh, because uh, due to my skeptical nature, I repeat the process and I die. But I think. This time around, I think I figure it out. Basically, you actually have to use the bugs to your advantage once again. And, well, I managed to do that. So, yeah, I think, yeah, all oh, right, yeah. Instead, instead, instead of missing the block, I hit the bug. Aren't I great, guys? Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not sure if I die. Oh, no, I don't. I don't use the bug. I use my... <laughs> I switch back to a uh, normal pip. A um, normal pip? Yeah, the block pip. And now I'm trying to get the villager. But these guys take a while to respawn. Yeah. So uh, you're just going to see me jumping about like a crazed maniac for a while until I can actually uh, get things right. Like, now. Now I get it right. That guy's pose, though. Amazing. So, now it's figuring out. Yeah, there you have it. And I complete the level just like that. Now, that's how you complete the level. With 1,730 pixels and uh, three villagers. That's amazing. So, now we've got... Which one? It's 3738. Yeah, we have 37, which is the normal level, and then 38 with the boss at the end. If I remember, we didn't actually get any sort of power up this um that one. Oh yeah, this is uh this is the zoom function that I've literally not been using. Basically that zoom fun uh, function allows you to just zoom back on the map and just pick the area. Uh thanks for saving my high pip. Yeah, now and I'm just like going through everyone that I haven't met or I haven't or I think I haven't met I think that's the words I want to use but I think the majority of everyone I've already met we go into the blacksmith as well and uh, yeah I've got no money to buy anything I will be trying to get 8,000 for the powering but besides that I won't be doing much else just messing around with the buttons now amazing uh, okay so we leave we leave, and basically we're just exploring the town because I want to know, want to know what we've got. Oh look, it's Bill Nye the science guy, but his name's actually Percy. Unfortunately. But, okay. I think that's about the end of the video as well, so, uh, just, oh yeah. I was making a comment on how ugly this guy was. That guy is so ugly. Not ugly, but he's sad. Like, extremely sad. Well, guys, I will see you all in the next video. Like and subscribe and follow me on Twitter and Facebook. Goodbye.